All right, day six, there's a huge hairy bunny beast that seems to be hiding in one of the pipes. Um, we'll go ahead and take care of this with that axe. That axe, though. Hello, everyone. Remember this? I think I'm ready again. Let's play. All right, keep Timmy alive until rescue comes. Get rescued by the military or ally from other wastelanders. So pretty much military or the scout handbook and first aid kit are disabled. All right, it's been a minute since we tried this challenge out. Let's see, what do we got here? We got four cans of soup, four bottles of water, the gas mask, the padlock, bug spray, a tattered map, portable radio, flashlight and our axe and our harmonica all right it could have been worse surely at least we're all here but what happens if one of us gets radiation poisoning or an injury what will we do then without medical supplies the scout book was lost to the blast as well if no other scouts made it timmy may be the only person in the wasteland who ever took a survival class all we used and we used to make fun of him for it well we're not laughing now little timmy needs to be protected at all costs just what we're gonna do. Mary Jane's been dropping hints that it's a special day for her today. We had to think about it hard. Oh, it was her birthday. Oh no. Um, and after eliminating your average festivities, the anniversary of the great barbecue we had three years ago, International Popcorn Day, realized she's talking about her birthday. Sure, let's give her some bug spray. All right, day four, we sent Teddy out. So far, everybody's been okay. Mary Jane had a good birthday. We solved a little leakage problem. We're doing fine. There is, however, someone knocking on our door. Everybody's here. But I kind of want to say yes to opening. Day five was about a horrible mistake. Uh, it was. Someone started shooting at us. But that was fine. It says that a shot grazed us. Oh, I guess, yeah. It got Dolores real quick, but that's fine water day for everybody. All right, day six, there's a huge hairy bunny beast that seems to be hiding in one of the pipes. Um, we'll go ahead and take care of this with that axe. That axe, though. And all of our cans are saved. Day eight, it looks like Teddy's back. Oh, hello, buddy. Oh, he literally just went up to our old house. Got two cans of soup, a new map, two cans of, or two bottles of water. All right, could have done worse. Teddy, you're gonna get both of those. All right, and on day eight, it looks like we're gonna start listening to the radio. Hopefully we'll hear a transmission and we can uh, start getting Timmy, my boy, out of here. All right, and on day nine, we're gonna be sending out Dolores with the gas mask. I also gave her some water just in case. All right, and on day 10, we found a brick fell and there's a terrible stench coming from the hole. So we're gonna try and figure out what it is. Can't have Timmy get sick was just a rat and we found a, an extra can of soup. All right, day 12, we're listening to the radio again. Hopefully this will be the military. Aha, day 13. Yep, the government is sending people. We also just heard the, uh, the uh, telephone. So I'm gonna go ahead and have someone go out and answer it. But I don't really think we're gonna put too much behind, too much behind uh, the twins this time. Meet the local law enforcement. That's a new achievement. Uh, all right, day 14, we had Dolores here come back. Oh, it looks like she got so much water. All right, it looks like Dolores went to the fire department where she was able to get three bottles of water. All right, and everybody needs to eat today. All right, and on day 15, we're sending Teddy out for day 16. All right, and day 16, we're listening to the radio again. Sounds like we heard something. Oh my goodness! Dolores is uh, no more. Dolores suffered with her injuries for too long. She was definitely infected. Got it. Okay. Um, well, good news, the government did answer us. And we'll hear from them again in a few days. I'm a little paranoid, so we're going to feed the kids, actually, today, too. And we'll go ahead and send Mary Jane to find whatever was secretly scratched on our on our uh, map, which was nothing. All right, there was a soup thief among us. We blamed Mary Jane. Okay, 
who was so angry, she actually uh, destroyed a stoop can. Great, that's just what we need. Sometimes, a sudden urge to play an instrument takes over us, to create beautiful sounds to be shared with the world around us, to sing and play and have cute mutated animals come to our feet to listen, like a post-apocalyptic Snow White, shall we? I mean, we do have the harmonica. Why not? Day 20. Oh cute! We got little mutant cockroaches. The funky roaches haven't really left us, to be fair, they aren't causing too much trouble. Um, just this morning when we opened our eyes, we saw them standing in a perfect line in front of us. As if they're waiting for something. Sure, let's give them a show! The end? No! I take it Teddy didn't come back. Can't beat him join him. We figured the wretches are craving more of our music, so we fulfilled their unspoken request. They started they started joyfully prancing around, uh, again creating fun shapes on the floor. All of a sudden, they all left in one line. We, went, uh, we thought the show was over, but they soon came back in a group carrying supplies! Ah, one soup, one water. But Teddy Boy did not come home. But we failed again. Alright, we survived 21 days. I think we're gonna give this one more go. One more go. It can't be this hard to get Timmy out of here. Alright, day one. What do we got? Um, pretty much all the same stuff. Looks so we have four soup, four water, we have some ammunition, a gas mask, a tattered map, portable radio, flashlight, axe, we got some checkers this time, and our harmonica. Day four, we're sending Teddy out again. Day seven, it is Mary Jane's birthday again. We have nothing that we can gift her, so she's probably getting out. Day eight, in or out? Okay, in. Mary Jane's still here. And it looks like, what did Teddy bring back? He went to our house again. We got two, uh, two soup, two water, a rifle? Okay, and some bug spray, but we lost our gas. Of course we did. Well, Eddie, you still get soup and water for your effort. And day eight, we're gonna try and make contact with the military. Uh, and on day nine, good news everyone, the government's now saying they're dropping crates. Unfortunately, Teddy destroyed our only way to get them. All right, day 11, most of the fallout's gone, so we are going to have someone be ready for an expedition. Okay, and old man Jim is outside. Something I've learned is that if you're in a Hail Mary moment, like you need food or water or something, if you accept old man Jim's rock, then he will come back later and and uh, give you something, whatever it is you need. And we're sending Dolores out. All right, day 14, we found a map with a uh, marked spot on it. We're gonna go ahead and send Mary Jane out to go investigate it. Everyone's kind of fulfilling the same duty that they did last time. And she got us a new map. All right, in day 15, while we're moving things around, we opened a door. We used the flashlight to see what's behind it, which was a good call. It was nothing. Day 17, it looks like Dolores is back. What'd you bring us, baby girl? We were hoping this expedition would be successful. Too bad that was not the case. <sighs> useless, useless mother. On the bright side, we can at least listen to some radio chat. All right, we're going to send Teddy out again because he seems to be the only one good at getting anything for the family. Day 20, it sounds like we got some news. And the news was that the military wants to know where we are and we should leave playing cards outside. Too bad all we have are checkers. <sighs> we will be saved. Timmy will be saved. All right, day 21, we found a safe behind our map. Let's try and open it. We had a padlock in it, cool. Seems kind of weird to have a lock inside a safe. Kind of cancel each other out there, don't they? All right, there's survivors outside asking for some aid. I'm gonna give them the soup can. I'm really hoping that they'll help us, like, come in clutch the next time that we have to leave. Oh god, Timmy's sick. They were very grateful. Oh god. Um, Timmy, we, we gotta, we gotta keep you good. We found an unsigned letter today. The stranger asked us for help. Apparently there are a few survivors. Engraved me supplies. We have a chance to help them. Saying so we won't regret it. We should make several people very, very happy. Should we do it? Sure. I know I'm kind of playing fast and loose with our supplies, but it's day 24 and Teddy came back. Sick. Teddy came back sick. Awesome. It was the siblings, okay. Uh, Teddy went to the zoo and it looks like he brought back a water. Oh god, everyone's sick. Um, we're relieved at first when we figure out it wasn't so weird. Okay. Alright, we're sending Dolores outside and we're just, we gotta let Mary Jane pass, unfortunately. Yep, she left. Alright, and we're having trouble with the ventilation system. Let's go ahead and put some bug spray in it, cause that's gonna be real great for us. Which was the right thing to do, there were mutant insects in there. Day 27, there's a trader who wants ammunition. We have some ammunition to trade. And Teddy's gone. But if you give us a can of soup, okay, that's not bad. Dolores, I need you to come back. Let's send a very sick Timmy to... We want to send a very sick Timmy to go raid elderly people? No, because then the twins won't save us. Dang, another transmission from the army, but we don't have cards still. All right, day 31. There's a suitcase outside. Yes, we... We can't get much worse than this. Something's gotta give. Uh... 
It was an extra soup can. Day 33, Dolores came back. Sick, Dolores came back sick too. <sighs> but she did bring back an extra can of soup and an extra water, that's perfect. We can, we can do this. The siblings visited us today. They told us they're searching for a safe place and they need our map. Okay, yeah, take our map. Oh my goodness, I just need to keep them alive until the twins can come and get us. I don't want to risk Timmy. Oh my god, day 35. We were trying to banish Timmy for his comic books. Dolores, it's almost like you don't understand the assignment. All right, day 36, we're gonna send Dolores out. Don't know how well this is gonna go, but we'll see. Oh my gosh, we have the Merry Men banging on our door outside. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We have ten items. I think they honestly would consider that rich. All right, day 38, we're gonna shoot at the cockroaches, see what happens. Nothing. We just showed him who's boss. All right, we made it all the way to day 40. It sounds like there's something from the army. Yep, and we need playing cards. I don't think the army's coming for us, everybody. I don't think they're coming. The end. Dolores didn't come back. Goodness. All right, twice, two times. I'm able to keep Timmy alive. That's not the problem. The problem is these ding-dang parents need to understand how to stay the freak alive. All right, well, if you made it this far in the video, go ahead and leave a like. Leave a like if you uh, think that I would make a great post-apocalyptic parent, because uh, I sure know I'd do better than freaking Teddy or Dolores. Comment below, have you done this challenge? This is, I think, my third attempt on the channel, not even just in general, on the channel, doing this, and I still can't get it. I can, I can survive with Timmy. I can. I've done it before, just not in this challenge. Comment if you've done it and how. Subscribe if you're new to the channel, or if you're not new, just not subscribed yet, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!